Hello there everybody. Today we are looking at a very basic position. White is on the move and we are winning this if we play it right. Our pawn is going in this direction. I think you need to be an experienced uh, puzzle solver to crack this one, but uh, try anyway. Uh, I don't I don't want to get away too much information because I don't want to spoil anything, so I leave it like that for now. You should pause the video and see if you can find the solution. If you cannot, come back and I will give you a clue. All right, go ahead. And welcome back. So if you found the solution to this, congratulations, you did good. If you couldn't find it, if you tried a lot and you still couldn't find it, here's a clue for you. The uh, common rule of uh, chess puzzle is that if the king and the rook is still in its original position, we would assume that a castle is uh, available. So that is the clue. With that information, if you want to give it another shot, pause the video and get, again and uh, try to find the solution. Go ahead. All right, and welcome back again. So now let, let's look at this solution. We have our pawns going up here. And uh, black wants to stop it, of course. If we try this uh, simple solution with rook d1, it's not winning, actually. Uh, the, the king cannot go here, and he cannot go here either, really, because then we push d7, and this will become a queen. And black will have to uh, sacrifice his rook, and we are winning. But Black has another smart move. If we play rook d1, he will just move his rook to the other side. And then after d7, he can simply give a check, exchange the rooks, and then stop the pawn. And this is a draw. So the right solution here is just play d7 straight out. Okay, you see, black can attack with his king. And what to do now? Well, the simple solution is that we just promote this to a queen or something. Queen is best because forces black to take. And now, look at this position. Here we have long castling with a check, a tempo move, and we are attacking the rook at the same time. This uh, is called the Thornton Trap. It's a trap where you castle long and just grab something, normally a rook. Uh, so it's like an offensive castling, really cool. And this is how you win this, of course. Just let's start looking from the start. What if we uh, started with long castling? Well, it's not going to win because black then can play rook a2. He threatens to come to a8 with this rook and stop. And also the same as we looked from the beginning. If we try to push the pawn right away, he has this maneuver and exchange and then stop it with the king. So we need to go with the pawn first, promote it, and then finish up with a long castling, take the rook, and a beautiful win for white. And uh, if you didn't uh, know this, now you learn. In the puzzle, there's always a possibility to castle unless something says otherwise. All right. Have a great day. I hope you enjoyed this. See you later.